Now we've talked a lot about filtration on the power steering system. Well, it's also important on other systems like the fuel system. So we've got a little bit of rough idle going on with the truck, and we haven't quite gotten through all the diagnostics yet, but one thing we're gonna do is go ahead and throw a fuel filter on. Now I know a lot of you out there cannot raise your hand that you've changed your filter in the last 50K. It's pretty simple, you can do it at home. Uh, a couple of wrenches, line wrenches work best, you don't round them out. And on some of the newer stuff, they got you know, quick release hoses, and you can get some real simple tools like this, and it'll slip over the line, and you can just insert them in, pop the little release spring, boom, the lines pop off. Piece of cake. Now what that does is it keeps all that debris and things from moving their way forward into some of the more high dollar stuff like your injectors. Now this is a sort of a neat system on this vehicle. It kind of bridged the gap between throttle body injection and multi-port fuel injection like you think of with the individual injectors up on the rail. Now this is what we got on the truck here and it's somewhat called the Spider. It's a central SFI system. Now if you look in here, I mean they're tiny little holes, tiny little orifices with little needles and seats and things. So you get debris in there and you're going to have some troubles. Now this is kind of a neat piece from Boss Tech. Now they do a lot of reman injectors, everything from your domestics and foreigns, uh, you name it. And what they'll go through is they'll save you a lot of money from having to buy new, which is great. And they'll go through and they'll replace all the things that either go wrong with the original injector or the type or things that go wrong over time like some of the plastic connectors, the hoses, the fuel regulators, that sort of thing. Now this guy fits up underneath the intake manifold. You can see the fuel in and out, you know, the regulator as I mentioned. And you know, some of the things you want to check to figure out if you need to replace injectors are things like you know, rough idle and stuff. Once you've eliminated that it's your you know, electrical system, you know, spark plugs, wires, and coils, you can look at things like fuel trim. You know, one of these might be a little bit clogged or sticking, and all of a sudden this bank is now going to be running richer because your O2 sensor is going to try to compensate. So now you're throwing a lot of extra fuel through the engine out the tailpipe, which now that's a lot of dollars. Yeah. So there's a lot of fuel economy that can be picked up by maintaining your system you know, all the way up to the injector side. So Boss Tech can help you out. They got all the American you know, reman stuff right here in the States. Call them up and they can pretty much set you up. You might not get the spider, <laughs> but you will get the parts that you need. It really is one freaky looking piece. I know, man. It's, it's a, crazy a trip. little guy.